My name is John. I'm from uh, Washington, D.C. I'm active duty military and uh, extremely glad that uh, Don't Ask, Don't Tell has been repealed. Um, as a uh, mid-grade officer, it uh, was uh, very difficult. I felt that uh, there was a glass ceiling in place, that um, Don't Ask, Don't Tell perpetuated um, lies. It, it, it forced us to be something we were not and to um, betray the very oath we took uh, in order order to um, appease other people's prejudices. And uh, now that it's been repealed, I, I feel like um, I could do 20 years, uh, that I've been in a relationship now for seven years, and uh, it was very difficult to be both in the service and uh, have a steady relationship. Um, it is possible. There, it was tough a lot of times. But uh, now that Don't Ask, Don't Tell has been repealed, uh, I, I see us staying together uh, for for, uh, well, the rest of our lives and uh, possibly starting a family and um, it, it's it's almost a rebirth um, now we can communicate openly with each other we can help each other we can provide mentorship to the guys who are behind us who uh, maybe got out I, I, I feel like so many guys and uh, women got out um, because they didn't feel like they were loved by the organization, and and right now we need you. We need you back. Uh, if you're if you're fit, if you want to come out and serve, uh, come out and serve. And uh, we, we we appreciate your service. And uh, I uh, I hope the best for for everybody out there.